You're watching a segment of The Splash, Greater West Bloomfield's news magazine show. The West Bloomfield Police Memorial is one of our area's most attended events, and this year was no different, as community leaders, local residents, and even other law enforcement came out to support our nation's fallen officers. But the ceremony was made even more bittersweet due to the retirement of one of our own here in West Bloomfield. Here's The Splash's Lawrence Nyland with the story. Law enforcement deaths this year have risen 23% over the last year. Remind us how dangerous this job is and how precious is life. Since 2009, the West Bloomfield Township Police Memorial has become a well-honored tradition within the community. The event, which was started in recognition of National Police Week, memorializes all of Michigan's law enforcement officers who have died in the line of duty and brings together residents from all walks of life to remember their sacrifice. It means so much that uh, so many people in this community, whether they be in law enforcement, education, uh, the clergy association, just everybody uh, coming out and supporting law enforcement, especially during this time, which is very somber to remember those who have died in the line of duty. And so it's heartwarming and gratifying. And the event isn't just for the community's benefit, but the police departments as well. We enjoy a great community relationship here. It's not something we take for afraid to take for granted. You know, every day the officers really know that they have to go out and do all the, do the right things so that the, well, that public trust is maintained. And so, and we're very fortunate here because we have a really a great team of not only officers and dispatchers and police service agents and civilian staff. We have a really good thing going here, and I'm, I'm really privileged to be the chief of police. For the past eight years, Officer Rick Trebalsi has wholeheartedly given of himself into making each memorial possible. But as he prepares to hand off the reins, his legacy within the township will be as long-lasting as those he's helped to commemorate. So this is bittersweet, uh, leaving here after you know, 26 years, but uh, that's the way it's supposed to be. People come and go and institutions continue, so it's time for somebody else to take over. He's already done a great job moderating this event. It'll be difficult maybe to do it moving forward without him here, but um, he's always welcome to come back and take it over again. I think we'll, we'll think about that too. So. Reporting in West Bloomfield for The Splash, I'm Lawrence Nyland. Thanks, Larry. And thanks also to Officer Rick for his many years of service within our community. We'll definitely miss seeing you around here, my friend. And for anyone else interested in seeing the full ceremony online, you can visit our website at civiccentertv.com slash 2017 Police Memorial. Thanks for watching a segment of The Splash. To catch the entire show or other segments, watch us on Comcast Channel 15 or AT&T Channel 99. Or look us up online at thesplash.tv and listen to us on WBLD 89.3, the all-new Lakes FM.